girl Gladys, aka Is That Your Hair, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to 20 Dollar Tuesdays. 20 Dollar Tuesday is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute yet super affordable wigs for the lovely $20 price range and below. So let's just jump right in. Last week on Twenty Dollar Tuesday, y'all were showing me so much love for those Amazon headband wigs. If you're late to the party, let me just catch you up. Headband wigs are basically wigs that you can wear with a headband, whether it be a synthetic half wig or the human hair wigs that have come out with headbands attached. So two weeks ago, I was like, let me scroll through Amazon to see if they have any of these headband wigs popping, and they sure did. I showed them to y'all, and y'all loved it. So I was like, yo, I may as well do a part two. So I'm bringing you four more headband wigs that I found on Amazon that are in the $20 price range. I've only opened one so far, and from what I can tell, I'm a little surprised. <laughs> And the other three I haven't opened yet, so we are just gonna be going through this thing together, okay? I know last time, some people were commenting that things were selling out, and I have uh, provided additional links for some wigs that I found with other companies, as well as just other wigs in case you want to try a different style. I'll be doing the same thing. There are lots of links down below of similar styles, duplicate styles, and just different styles. So if you see something that you like as you watch this video, I highly suggest you just add it to the cart and purchase it because last week's video, a lot of those wigs sold out very quickly. I was surprised, wasn't expecting that. <laughs> but I'm really glad to see that you all enjoyed it. I've also done two other videos featuring synthetic half wigs with headbands that a lot of you really, really love. Part one and part two, definitely check those out in the description box. They'll be linked down below and they'll also be in the end screen. So are y'all ready to see this, this next batch of Amazon headband wigs? Are y'all ready for that? Because if you are, keep on watching. All right, y'all, this is the first wig I have here. And just know that the links to all these wigs are down in the description box and you'll see the price. Again, they are all in the $20 range. I think the highest priced one was might have been like $26.99, something like that. But this cutie right here is a nice kinky curly one with this green headband attached. And as I showed you before, there's this little like drawstring here that tightens it, which I actually like a little better than the Velcro, only because with the Velcro on Certain human hair headband wigs, sometimes it like leaves a flap out and it's just kind of flapping, I have to tuck it under. But I know I can also add a strip of Velcro if I wanted to, to that flap. But I really like this drawstring idea because it feels super snug, like it's not going anywhere. You can see here, this is just a close up of what the curls look like. Look at that, like a, a type three type of hair, like three B, three C hair and I must say as I'm touching this this feels very soft <laughs> again I don't know what I was expecting last time either but I just didn't expect them to feel soft I thought they were gonna feel kind of harsh kind of rough but this is mimicking like human hair kinky curly very nicely and it's like a nice number two almost number four color this is cute y'all so let's just let's just toss her on Okay, this is what she looks like just straight on. I love the bounce of the curls. I'm not a big fan of this green headband though. I don't know, like it, it's just okay to me. Um, as you can see, the color of this hair is definitely to me like a four because my number two hair is not matching all the way, but that is okay. You will notice that these with these curls, they tend to get frizzy pretty easily, so just be mindful of that. It is synthetic, so once it frizzes up like this, it's not just gonna bounce back to this type of curl here. So normally I would just cut those frizzies out, but this is, this is a dupe, y'all. This is definitely a dupe. Let me, let me see how I wanna style this. I'm just like pulling it. Let me see if I wanna um, flip it over. Y'all, this one is really cute. <laughs> I really just fluffed it out as much as I wanted just because I wanted to get this a little bit more even. And I like that it already falls into this nice 
V shape after fluffing it out. I would definitely cut out some of these fuzzy areas, but I'll probably do that later. But yeah, what do y'all think of this one? Are we are we giving a dupe vibe or not? I feel like the fuzzy pieces are kind of what gives gives it away as far as it being a synthetic wig. But when you touch this. It is hard to tell that this is synthetic. Amazon, what are you doing out here? Like, what's really good? Because, come on, come on. Now, I have quite a few of you say in the comments that you wish you could change the headband. So we're gonna try something. Okay, we're gonna try something. I actually bought these headbands. They're like sleeve headbands. I'm gonna show them to you now. And I want to put it over this headband and just see how it looks. So these are some of the sleeve headbands that I bought. And actually this is like a similar color to this right here. These are what I bought. And I did feature some sleeve headbands in my natural curly review, the unit from Curls Curls. And I was like, yo, where do I find these sleeve type headbands? And I found some on Amazon. So they stretch out like this, they're very stretchy. And you can basically roll them like this and put them over your head. So that's what I'm gonna do right now, just to show you all how it looks if you wanted to just put a headband on top of what's already given. And also, like I've said before, if you do not have edges, not a problem. I think headband wigs are pretty much for everyone. So if you have thinning edges or no edges, you can just wear the headbands, especially these sleeve ones, down on your ears like so. But I'm going to push mine back a little to let my edges show. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> if you feel like you get one of these wigs and you do not like the headband, you can literally just put one of these sleeve headbands right on top, right? Or you can even use one of these headbands. I bought this off of Amazon recently because I saw my girl Wheezy Wig Reviews. She reviewed some half wigs with headbands and I loved this one. It's like wide in the front and then it comes into a bow in the back. And this gives a lot of great coverage, especially if you have thinning edges. So you can wear this on top as well. And so with this sleeve headband here, you can pull it up in the back if you want to. Ooh, she's cute. Hello. You see how I pulled it up in the back? Y'all see that? And you can pull it up as high as you want. Oh, I think this is super cute. It's definitely looking dense, but I think the ponytail is still cute. Like, what do y'all think? Let me know. I think that's a look. What? <laughs> 20 dollars it just started and it's already on and popping. Yes, I'm feeling that. Hello. So how are you feeling about this one? Drop some comments down below. I mean, off the break. She's kinky curly. She could be worn up like this with this sleeve headband. And links to the headbands are down below. Amazon affiliate link. Support your girl, support this channel. But this is a look. Like all of this right here with my, my bodysuit that I got on is a look. <laughs> and it goes with my denim jacket too. Woo woo, here for it. All right y'all, so the next headband wig that I have is this nice reddish cinnamon color i think it resembles the 33 color on the color spectrum i really like this color definitely a nice fall color and you see this pattern headband similar to what i showed in my last video so same construction here let's put her on I literally threw this joint on in two seconds and then we are done. <laughs> I don't even have to really do anything to these curls. Like they are perfect just the way they are. Do y'all see this? How cute is this? This was a fan favorite. In my last video, a lot of y'all liked this in a natural color. So I'm here to show you in this color, okay? Now, you can... Wear the headband like this, especially like over your ears if you're not trying to show your edges. But your girl has these new sleeve headbands, so we're about to put on this sleeve one right now. So let's see what it's looking like. I'm gonna push this back, throw on this sleeve headband, 
from Amazon, links in the description if you just got here. Premiere party, what's up, how y'all doing? Let me know how y'all are feeling about these wigs thus far. sleeve headband you can wear it over your ears but i just want to show y'all that no edges are needed for real for real i am gonna put my ears out but you don't need edges for these wigs look how cute this looks this bump back here is my bun okay i didn't try to flatten my bun but if you have hair you can definitely do that i really really like this now here's one thing that i would do for this headband let's say you want to rock it like this I would actually experiment with cutting out this part right here. I would just do it. And I'm not gonna do it right now because I actually like this headband that it comes with. I'm fine with it. Let me know how you're feeling about this sleeve headband here. I think it's very cute. But I'm really fine with how it came just like this. This is so freaking adorable. I love it. Now, for those who are concerned about the color matchup, if you have dark hair like I do and it not matching with this bun, I decided to pull this out. This is a color spray, and I have it in a dark brown. I bought this from a beauty supply store some years ago. It's just been hanging out in my house. But I do want to see what it looks like if I spray a little bit around the perimeter as far as making it look like I have some type of darker root. So let's just see what it looks like. So y'all see that? You see how it's like creating more of a darker root effect versus being this um, cinnamon brown color all throughout. So that way it will look more natural. Now here's the thing. This color spray is just temporary, so it will come off. So you have to be careful with this. I have to experiment with it some more. Like once it dries, I wonder if I put hairspray if it'll like not get on my fingers. But for now, I'm just not going to touch the hair anymore because guess what, if I touch it, it will come off on my finger. But when it dries, I believe it doesn't come off as easily. I just wanted to show you all that as an option in case you wanted a quick little fix when it comes to having a dark root. This is my first time actually trying it for this purpose, but I'm glad that I did. And if I find this online somewhere, I will link it in the description box. I think this is super cute, y'all. Like, oh my God, I'm just loving these Amazon headband wigs. Let's move on to wig number three. All right, y'all, this is headband number three, another kinky curly unit, but this one has bangs and it has the similar green headband that I don't like. <laughs> this one also feels very soft, but this one feels, this one is definitely a little shorter and this one, I mean, it has the space in the back here as if it, they want it to be high up, but on the website, it looked like it was supposed to be kind of like a, a fro that comes out all around like this. Also, I noticed here, she has like these weird little curly cues and the track showing. Yeah, <laughs> not really feeling that, but we're just going to play around with her. So I'm just going to toss her on and see what she's looking like. So... These bangs are out of control. <laughs> what am I doing with these bangs, y'all? Mm -mm. Okay. I'm definitely filling this here in the back. This is cute. This is cute. This is not. So we're going to have some cutting to do. I'm going to, let's see how I'm going to do this. Like it's not necessary for the bang to come away all, all the way out here. So I'm going to cut that aside and see what's happening. <laughs> oh God. Goodness, this looks so much better. I keep telling y'all, don't be afraid to pick up these scissors 
and get to work on these wigs because the way these bangs were looking before, <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no way I'm letting you walk out the house looking like that. So this right here is a much better look. I think something I would do, I don't have it on hand right now and I'm like running out of time because the sun is going down. I would spray this with water and like brush it out some just to see if I can get this to lay down because I feel like these curls are sticking up due to how it came out the pack. So I would encourage you all to do that. Again, these wigs are only like 24, five, six dollars. So please feel free to have at it. But I love this glorious fro in the back. Look at it, look at it in the back. Look at it! <laughs> this is absolutely beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful fro. And I'm not even worried about what was happening in the front here because it's covered up with the kinky curly. That's one thing I really appreciate about my natural hair type. You don't have to really worry about it being super perfect like you would with like sleek styles because this type of hair does its own thing and you just have to choose to embrace it. Point blank, period. Let me see if I, I can put it with another headband, hold on. I'm gonna try it out with this red headband here that I got from Amazon. And look at that, just like that, the headband switch up is real, yes. For those of you who've been asking about wanting to switch up the headband, here's your answer. Just throw another headband on top. And if you're feeling froggy, maybe cut a little bit of the headband out. I wouldn't suggest cutting the entire headband out because the way some of these wigs are set up, the hair is actually attached to the headband. It's like stitched into the headband for some of these wigs, so I wouldn't do that. No edges, no problem, yes. Love, love it. If you look in the back, some of the green might be showing. I think it's, is it showing? I don't know. I'll know when I edit the video. <laughs> or y'all can let me know, but at least from the front, you can see that it is a brand new headband on your head. This is so freaking pretty. I cannot keep my hands out of this hair. Who's on the website? Come on. Let me tell you, it's an add to cart kind of day. And now it's Tuesday. Some of y'all got paid on Friday and some of y'all get paid this Friday. Which one are you? I'm just saying, look at this bounce. <laughs> this is so freaking pretty. Oh my gosh. I don't even wanna take this off my head. I really like this Amazon headband cause it's like thick and it feels stretchy and durable. Like I feel like this is going to make it through quite a few machine washing. You don't have to worry about this stretching out anytime soon. This is so pretty. I don't wanna do anything to it. Tell me this is not my hair. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> All right, y'all, I have one more wig to show you, and it's a little bit different from the wigs that I'm showing you right here, so I don't know what to expect with this last one. So if you're ready to see it, just keep on watching. All right, before the sun goes down, the last headband wig that I have is twisted. Ah! It's twisted into this bun. Hmm, this smells a little. Okay, so it has a little bit of a factory smell. I feel like you can spray something to get rid of that. Look at the twist pattern here. It's done pretty neatly and it's twisted into a bun. I saw it on the website and I was like, this is so unique, I must try this for y'all. So same type of drawstring, except it's a different color. It's beige and not black. And we have this interesting pattern here. Let's toss it on. This is, this is different. <laughs> oh, interesting. Hold on, is it lopsided or am I tripping? So I feel like it could easily fall to the side, but this is what it looks like. This is, this is interesting. I don't think I care for this band that it comes with, but that's cool because now we know we can switch out these headbands right on top without a problem. So I'm gonna do that right now. I'm gonna try this green pattern. Okay, this is how it looks with the green pattern. Looks like I like wrapped up my hair with some twists. Hmm, hmm, hmm. This is actually kind of cute. I'm, I'm still adjusting to this. I don't, I don't know. This part, mm -mm. I don't like how it keeps falling back here. I need it to stay up here. So I would definitely pin this somehow with a clip to make it stay forward because I can imagine if you're like out and about, it'll just shift, you see that? It'll just fall over. We don't want that. And you see what I'm talking about? Like with these wigs, the hair right here 
is actually stitched to the headband itself as well as the cap. So it's not really too wise to cut it. <laughs> Look at the back. I like the idea. It's just, it just needs a little bit of work. But I think it's an interesting concept. Not my favorite, but I wanna like it. I don't know, tell me how you feel about this one in the comments down below, especially with me adding this headband. Again, don't worry if it comes with a headband, y'all. Put, put a headband over it and call it a day. Yes. Uh, okay, you see how it's looking here? I like twisted styles like this though, so I would definitely make this work. I'm gonna have to tweak this one a little bit more, but y'all get the gist. I think this was a $26.99 one. All links in the description box, so please, please have a field day. Click my links, check it out, add to cart, yes. All right, y'all, let me know which one you like the best down in the comments. Overall, this is definitely one of my favorites, that's why. Overall, this is definitely one of my favorites. That's why I had to put her on. I'm really feeling these Amazon headband wigs, y'all. I love the ease, the durability, the convenience. Y'all saw how I put those wigs on literally in less than 10 seconds. Five seconds, I mean, come on. It doesn't get any easier than this, and the price is right. So, premiere party, talk to me and let me know how you feel. Everyone else that's watching, comment down below. And if you wanna be a part of the premiere party, please turn on your notifications so that you see when I drop my videos. And of course, if you're new here, tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss anything coming up. I do have a giveaway going right now for a ponytail lookbook I did on Monday, so definitely check that out. That video will be listed in the description box. And if you wanna see my other headband wig videos, check them out over here to the right of me. Thank y'all so much for supporting me during this time. We are almost at 15K, I'm hyped, I'm so hyped. I love y'all. Thank you for joining me for $20 Tuesday. I'll see you next time, bye.